So this is our 13th client council and essentially what it is, is it's all of our clients, so South Africa's top corporates, CSI managers, CSI departments coming together and sharing ideas. Um, it's the one it's the one sort of sex or the one industry in South Africa where you can be a competing bank or a competing product but you actually sit around a round table because ultimately everyone's here to do good and to see how much social impact they can impart uh, on behalf of their corporates. So we had over 20 corporates today. We shared um, case studies, case studies from where uh, graduates from Vodacom um, created an app for Rise Against Hunger, an m and &E app as, a, as an example. NASPAS that builds ECD sensors that started with uh, five people in the finance department as, a, as an example. And then we also had some friendly competitions. So we showed each other like the top five performing uh, corporates in terms of connections and the difference they were made and their beneficiary hours and how many hours were logged, etc. So uh, overall a very good day and I think, I mean, as you can see in the background, everyone's still mingling, everyone's still sharing ideas, so hopefully we get a lot of social impact from this. The, I think the fact of the matter, and maybe it's because I'm a little bit negative, is I always feel that we can do more. I always feel that corporate South African can do more. Um, but everyone's having the right conversation, so taking a step back to COVID two years ago. We thought we didn't have a, co a company. Why? Because people traditionally like to volunteer uh, in person. And what we actually saw that came from this devastation and depressed people is a sense of they wanted to belong. So initially in COVID we saw very like little to no uh, activity on our platform. And then after an education, the corporate South Africa really woke up. And we've seen, I mean, two of our clients have had over 200% growth year on year from volunteering virtually during a pandemic where you have to wear a mask and you actually can't go physically. So we've actually seen during a pandemic an increase in volunteering. Also what we've seen is an increase in the type of volunteering. So instead of, you know, for instance, if I'm an accountant, don't go and paint a, a wall, rather go and audit a course's books. You know, in order for them to get their 18A. If you're a graphic designer, go and create a website for a course. Um, and of course, what we've learned during COVID is now you can do that from sitting in your pajamas at home. If you've got a phone, or if you've got a laptop connection, uh, you can volunteer. Yeah, it was a great day to be able to share our campaign with this audience. Um, I've had a bit of interaction with um, the audience after presenting, so that's been really cool to see their responses and to hear that their CEOs have been asking about the campaign and asking what it's all about. Um, and also just being able to see which channels of the campaign, the, the media channels, um, people are picking it up on. Uh, and a lot of excitement around us. We always look at the context of um, the environment that we're living in and, and we know it hasn't been great. It hasn't been a great few years. You've mentioned a few things. Um, and with a brand, how do you resonate with your customer or with South Africans at large um, without being authentic? I mean, that is just, it, it is something today people see through so easily. Um, and on top of that, I think what drove us to this direction was how do we actually get South Africans involved themselves? Um, we're great at moaning about our situation and our lives, um, but there is stuff that we, can, that we can do, even as an individual. As an individual, collectively, we can build a better future together. So that really has been the thinking behind it. So to create acts um, instead of just ads today. I think today people are going to be looking more to um, volunteering or altruism as a, as a way of communities connecting, of social cohesion. So I really think it will increase, um, especially at Hollard now that we've launched this, this campaign to say this is what we stand for. There's a more almost a resonance for the holidays to want to get involved. Um, and we're really planning our Mandela month and you're seeing these ideas coming through. Um, teams are coming together to say, I want to do this in my region or I want to go and volunteer at one of the causes that we've, we've um, listed with for good. So I really do believe that it's going to, I think we're going to see the uptake this year. For more stories like these, go to www.social-tv.co.za. Subscribe to us on YouTube and follow us on our social mediums.